the foreclosure process usually starts with what's called a uh, default letter. And that's a letter from your lender that says, uh, Mr. Smith, you, have, you failed to make X number of your mortgage payments, and if you don't pay up all your arrearages um, and all the money that you owe to us within 30 days, we're going to file a lawsuit. And that's what's called the, the foreclosure lawsuit, the complaint. Okay? It's a document that sets forth the allegations from the lender that says, Mr. Smith, we, owed, uh, we lent you X number of dollars. Uh, you were uh, required to pay X number of dollars per month as your mortgage payment, you failed to make X, Y, and Z payments, and as a result, we're trying to take back your home so that we could sell it to recoup the money that we had lent you. What you're required to do after that, within 20 days, is file what's called an answer. And the answer is going to either, um, agree, you're going to either agree with the allegations or deny the allegations or say without knowledge. Also within your answer, you're going to uh, want to set forth your uh, affirmative defenses if you have any. Once the pleadings have been closed, the judge will usually set the case for trial or there will be some other type of discovery work that's done, uh, motion practice that's done in the interim. Uh, it could last anywhere from six months usually to up to you know, three or four years. It really just depends on uh, the circuit and how backed up they are, the jurisdiction that you're in, and how backed up they are uh, with the, the current docket.